they are terrified of you. They are so terrified when they are around you, they are terrified and they can sense there is something strange about you. Whenever I give such prophetic words or whenever the Lord lays such prophetic words in my heart, it sounds cliche, but it's um, surprising that many Christians do not even know this about themselves. They don't even know that um, they are strange beings and um, if your spiritual eyes were to be opened for you to see who you are, you just look at yourself and you feel like you're an ordinary person. You are just a normal person. There is nothing much to you. But, you know, the Bible says that in the book of Psalms, it says God will give his angel charge over us. It means daily we are surrounded by angels. We might not even be aware of this, but that angelic presence around us sends a signal of fright to the devil or to the opponent or, or of um, someone who has an unclean spirit. When they look at you, they feel so scared. Remember the, 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 the man in the gatherings, the man that was possessed by by demons when he saw jesus there was something in jesus that propelled him i mean he was terrified and he ran to him and said do you, do you want to kill me before my time jesus had not said said anything to him but there was just this thing about the presence of jesus that made the demon to agitate and it is similarly with you you do not know but when you might think that you are ordinary and Maybe because you don't see any special thing happening about you. But you do not know the attempts the devil has had on you. You do not know the attacks. Your eyes are not open to see how much the devil has attacked you and how much God has saved you by his divine hand. So there is, there is something about you that terrifies them. There is a hand of protection that rests upon you and you do not even know it. If you are aware you are a strange being, you're going to be more confident even in your daily activities. You're going to be more confident even with the things you do because you have a divine backing. There is, a, there is an invisible hand that is always on you to protect and to guide you. Hallelujah. Did you receive this word with gladness? May the Lord bless you, keep your causes face to shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.